What is up, guys? It is Naylan. We are back with Condemned to Bloodshot. Uh, we're on the next chapter, which is Black Lake Lodge. Uh, we just finished finding something at the city museum connected to the mayor dying or something. Anyways, we're just going to get on to it. It just says continue game because, you know, you have to watch a cutscene to exit out. So we're just going to watch the cutscene together. X-ray shows you do have vocal cords similar to Van Horn's. But even more bizarre. I'm related to Van Horn, is that what you're saying? The thought crossed my mind. However, I was able to confirm that you do not share blood with that family. That's comforting. But you still think I'm connected somehow? Yes, I do. This seems kind of crazy, that's all. When you land, search the lodge thoroughly and learn as much as you can. It's been abandoned for decades, but I have a hunch mm. both Van Horns were there recently. <sighs> How much time we got left? Hey, buddy, did you hear me? Hello, Ethan. We don't have much time, so I'll get right to the point. Your old boss, Pharaoh, is trying to protect you. Have you taken a moment to contemplate the meaning of this? He's the one that hired you. He guided you through the ranks of SCU and has kept a close watch on your career. Perhaps he's done this under false pretenses. He may have ulterior motives. Using you. Something to think about when choosing your friends. Bird up. <clears throat> I miss collecting dead birds. It's such a uh, a good collectible item. All right. Do you really expect to find anything out here other than a cold death? All right. It's gonna be like an open world level or something. Oh, he's dead. <clears throat> Alright. Let's get moving. I'm getting some Slenderman vibes from this level. Mr. Thomas. Ethan. This is Deputy Director Farrell. Going there alone was not a good idea. Time you level with me. No bullshit. Yes, yes, you have every right to question me. Look, there are some of us who see you as a threat. The enemy. And where do you stand? I see you as an asset. A special tool too great to be wasted. Remendium. Remendium? I don't understand. Hello? I do not like this. Service station. Uh. Sorry, weird jump cut. My recording was interrupted. All right. We can't go that way, so we're going this way. Be expected, guys. <clears throat> Rosa, come in. You made it. How was your flight? Slept like a baby. Good. What do you have? Looks like a arm. There's a watch on it. Receiving evidence. A human arm? Ew. See if you can determine how fresh it is.
How'd you go about doing that? Maybe camera? Take a picture of the watch, maybe. Oh, there we go. What does it say? February 23rd at 12... 17 or something? It's 12 something. Where is it? Is that large hand or small hand? It's coming in now. Oops. <laughs> Unfortunately, that doesn't help. You better get a sample and send me the data. Receiving data. Okay, give me a moment. The skin tissue and blood type are definitely <clears throat> human in origin. I'm also detecting concentrations of mineral salts, urea, and amino acids in the sample. It looks like saliva. I need more time to analyze this properly. Keep looking for the lodge. I'll call you back in a few. Oh, am I going to be hunted by a bear? That wouldn't be very good. Unexpected. Your spectrometer is picking up concentrations of formaldehyde. This should be interesting. FYI, I'm still working on that saliva sample. It's a bare saliva. Hey, there we go. Vasopressin in the saliva. Very unusual. Oh. Arginine vasopressin is an amino acid that naturally occurs in mammals and is typically triggered by dehydration. Um, where does, where does arginine vasopressin come from? It's produced in the hypothalamus and secreted from the pituitary gland. Probably more info than you need right now, though. Alright, the numbers is going to increase the closer we get. Hopefully you guys don't mind if I'm a bit more quiet than usual. My parents are trying to sleep. Back's that. Rosa, I found a body. Can you make an ID? It's SEO. It's empty. And it's male. Okay, got it. Uh, I'm not able to make an ID <clears throat> with what you sent me. Regardless, I'm starting to get a bad feeling about this. Hell of a time to change your mind. Search the main lodge, then get the heck out of there. I can't get into it right now, but something weird is going on here, too. <clears throat> Alright, what's going to happen here? Do I get a weapon?
I think it's just a bear. Sorry. All right. Don't make me go up here. Don't tell me I'm gonna have to like sneak or something. Nah. <clears throat> nope, that guy is probably dead. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Uh, I'm out. I am out of here. I'm out of here, man. I'm out. Get out of here. Oh, where am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to go this way. guys doing up here shut up take this there's one shot left make it count i think i gotta blow up the tanks wait for my signal now did i do it or am i dying up to I don't understand this can't be a sanctioned SCU operation but they're using an SCU frequency find Van Horn's library but do it carefully and quickly all right 
Got through that bear sequence. Gonna sneak. Rosa, I found the door to the library, but it seems to be rigged with some sort of device. Possibly an explosive. Nothing is ever easy, is it? Let's see what Can is that? Can you give me more information? E-E-T-M callbacks. Give me a minute to look up this number. Wow, a D-E-T-M-12-X. Class A. High power detonator used to control multiple remote blast points. Real hardcore stuff. If you see a blinking LED, it means the detonator has been armed, and that's a problem. Ethan, you'll need to find and dispose of all the remote blast points before you can even breathe on that detonator. And the system is linked together by pneumatic tubes filled with a gas that glows under UV lighting. This should make finding the blast points easier. What? Oh my god. This is a deja vu to the previous game. None of them seem to go be going upstairs, so. from its housing and quickly get it outside. Throw it out a window if you can. <clears throat> Here we go. Goodbye. Oh, shit. Give me that. Sorry guys, I don't have a lot of good commentary. <laughs> I'm just like kind of Jay chilling. Right. Now I need to get five of these. It's kind of stupid, but alrighty. Dude, I bet you the bear is going to be in here, like, during the final part. Like, once I get, like, three of them.
Oh shit. Got him. Got more ammo? I need way more ammo. Thank you. Alright, UV lay. We're going. Oh, dude, do I need to throw it through that window? That was such a W throw. Well, at least the difference between this one and the uh, last game's mission was that stun gun battery. I'll take it. Oh, I can't take it. Is uh, like at least the UV lights that you have to follow disappear. Whereas, like in the last game, I was like following the same exact one for a long time. Oh, oh shit, 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 shit. Oh my god. Repeating, repeating. You're cooked. Oh, he's not cooked. He is not cooked yet. Alright. I'm gonna heal real quick. Alright, how much ammo do I got? 26? Oh, I got more. <clears throat> Two remaining. Go upstairs somehow. Gotta go fast. Excuse me. There we go. more of them. Oh, shoot. You know what? I actually uh, really enjoy this mission, uh, mission so far. Like, besides the bear sequence, uh, like, I can get down with this. Right, where is... <clears throat> oh, it's all the way up top, isn't it?
Alright, I got 13, 15 bullets. We're good. Is that fire poker? Can I use that as a weapon? Yo. That'd be crazy. Alright, there's one more. There's something in here, isn't there? Oh, hey, 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 chill, 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 chill. Ah! Ah! Alright, there's a lot of them. Bolts, we're good. Right, where is he? Get back here. You're cooked. Up. Oh, got that. All right, I think I got him. It says over <laughs> here somewhere. <laughs> See ya. <sighs> All right, maybe there didn't need to be like six of them though. There we go. <clears throat> Out of my way. Ethan, once all of the explosives are taken care of, get back to the detonator on the door as fast as you can. The countdown will be triggered. Return to the library. How do I return to the library? Rosa, I'm back at the detonator and you're right. It's counting down. Okay, quickly describe it to me. There are a couple possible configurations. 16, 16 keypad button. Two long, one short. Two, oh, three blinking lights. Let's say 12V. Oh wait, it's 120-12. There we go. What else are we missing here? And two canisters. Got it. Let's see. There was a timer, bro. Okay. There are a couple possible configurations. It's 120, 12. Two long, one short. Two cancers. Got it. Let's see. Okay, according to the information you sent me, you need to cut the cable on the right. I'm pretty sure of it. 
Rosa, the detonator's been deactivated. That was it? Alright. Okay, that was dumb. Rosa, Van Horn's computer is asking, what makes me special? It sounds like a password request. Vocal cords. Hello, Ethan. My future is uncertain, and so I leave this message to you. I made a promise to your parents long ago, but under the circumstances, I must break that promise. Your life, the real truth, was never to be revealed. But times have changed, and I fear danger has come to you like it has come to me. When your parents defected from the Oro, they were hunted down and killed. Your identity remained a secret, and only I knew of your existence. But that is no longer the case. The Oro has reached new levels of power, and they suspect your potential, and will, no doubt, see you as a threat. Now... I know foster homes were tough on you, but it was necessary to try and maintain anonymity. I hope you understand that I did my best. To complicate matters, my nephew, the person you know as SKX, just recently found hope in the Oro. This was never my intention. In fact, I've spent the majority of my life opposing the Oro. They were responsible for the death of my wife and child so many years ago. This put my nephew and me at odds, resulting in the current state of my affairs. He will stop at nothing to become one of them. And this is why our paths are crossing once again. Be careful, Ethan. The Oro's power is intoxicating, crippling, and... Oh. How do I change to the gun in the holster? Okay, I guess I'm not going to ever figure it out. Cooking me, guys. They're cooking me. I need a drink. Oh, help. Love it. There we go. Headshot. Mr. Thomas, get in. When your pilot failed to check in, Rosa sent me up here to look after you. Glad I came. Get in! Get me out of here, dog. Dorland's agents are everywhere. I'm afraid to step outside my lab. If they find out I've been helping you, I... I don't know what they'll do. What about Farrell? Nobody knows where he is. Right now, Dorlin and his agents are acting as if nothing is out of the ordinary. And the commissioner is here, and he and Dorlin are acting like old college buddies. I mean, the city is crumbling all around us. Riots, fires, murders, and now this? I, what's going on? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just worried something bad is about to happen. I'm sure there's an explanation for all this. Why is the commissioner there? Apparently they found him. 
Found who? SKX. Near the old bowling alley in Trenton. As wild as this may sound, SKX can help us. Speak to him. Ask him why all of this is happening. If he's got something to say, I'll get it out of him. Dolan's men are there, and they're not letting anyone near the scene. Leave that to me, Rosa. I can get us in. How do I know you're not working with Dorlin right now? I've taken my last order from that asshole. Ethan, W. LaRue is the only other agent I trust right now. There's nobody else. No one. We're on our own. <clears throat> Alright, that was the mission. Uh, it was pretty fun. I think they could have used one less of those cables I had to find. There's going to be some jump scut cuts or it's going to be fast forwarded. Uh, good investigator rating. I didn't care to check the news reports. I didn't feel like it. Access to toe stomp and nutcracker kick combos. Awesome. Well, we'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.